So I open y'all skulls up to the God of it, the people, the elements. So many things going on, like I told you, so you don't know what's what no more. The designs, you've seen, you seen it in shows with, with even heroes or what, what have you fighting different things. They call them things. They don't know what it is. You know. But here you have on the screen right here. I brought out this picture. And they talk about the six billion demons. Which there's way more than that. And I told y'all that demons are different from, from gods. A demon here and there may have a piece of a power regarding an element. But at the end they have to answer to that entire god that controls either fire or whatever have you. You know what I mean? I seen all of these birds and I said, I said, wow, there's at least nine birds on this picture. You know, the enemy that we fighting is very much physical, but it's also spiritual. So it's like we fighting both on top of these things. That's our, you know, stuff going on. I took this picture. This is a hundred million dollar painting right here, which is a prime example of even paintings. You know, they just slapped some stuff together, called it art, and it's worth a hundred million dollars. This is art. But when it comes to other people's art, they either don't want to pay you or they want to use, use you. Now, I'm not saying nothing wrong with this. You know, I've been doing this video stuff for four years and counting. The whole time has been nothing but foolery. I do not get money off of this. Now, you have people that even work regular jobs and they do videos, but it's not like this with major prophecies. You know what I mean? And if you feel like you could do it better, then y'all do it better. But I know what's going on a million percent. You know, it's inevitable. There's another trash right here. You know, so if you want to be somebody that do videos or if you do anything, if you have any type of skills, you don't have to be in Hollywood. It's easier to beat down regular folks. All you have to do is just isolate them, beat them down, beat them down, and, and, and get them to a point. Here's some more people celebrating. This, this topic is based on celebrity celebration. The God, it demands the enemy to do celebrations, rather it's physical or spiritual, you know, at clubs or whatever, for many different reasons. You know, just like God want us to acknowledge him and the things, the gifts that he gave us, so does Lucifer and the enemy and wants to be praised. You see these clubs, you see these different things and people, when they get rid of you, you got folks that walk, you see every day they never said nothing to you, this and that, but when you're gone, they celebrate. Your death, you know. Look at this fool on screen having the time of his life. They had a club celebration. Once you become a Hollywood sellout or a sellout, period, you, in most cases, you didn't really want to do it. They don't want to do it to some individuals. They love it. That's what they do. Sacrifices, talk to demons, etc., etc. Having the time of their life. The God demands that. You're giving over your conscious power. Your brain. It drains you. It may not seem like it. But that's what's going on. You go to these clubs. These people in the crowd. is giving over their power. Their spiritual power. To the celebrity. Which to help them perform. Etc. Etc. Here's, here's a family here. Celebrating Christmas right here on screen. Got on your black and white. They even got the babies doing this stuff. They tell the kids Santa Claus this, Santa Claus that. Once again, the reasons people do stuff. They celebration though. Every holiday. All of that stuff. Your death. The day you die. Just like they did me. And the visuals. They mocked me on the 10 situations with my with them, you know, destroying my, my mom. Look at these clowns on screen right here. Scott Dizak, Nicki Minaj, Future, Soulless Losers, having the time of their life. 
and they hide their pain with celebrations. Because if you don't do it, the God, the God going to think that you're, you're not happy. The celebrities is going to realize like, oh, you don't want to be around us? You don't like this life? We can send you back to where you started. It's worse of there. We guarantee you that. Like they did Neo in the Matrix. I bust heads open. Now, like I say, we don't forget or miss anything. Crumbs. Might as well have TVs on your head because individuals love this every minute of the day. This controls them all. They celebrate it. This is their God. Individuals worship it. Can't live without it. Fool having the time of his life once again in the crowd. Like I say, these symbols and signs give over power to the celebrity. Now, if, you ain't, if you're not spiritual, if you don't know black Jesus, if you don't know God, not if you believe, if you don't know, you're not going to understand this. It's just going one ear and out the other. Don't listen to these messages. You know, I know what y'all folks are doing. Like I say, if you're individuals claim to be who y'all is, you'll be doing this. It's even a Lion King celebration. Lion King one. See the hyenas? Let me go back to this picture. Uh, this picture look like this picture a little bit. Bunch of hyenas celebrating. Notice it was a song in the middle of this celebration. The lion that they worship, they had to do that. Celebro, Latin word, English, celebrate, celebrate, celebration, celeb celebrity, and celebrate, whatever that other one else. It's all in the same family. You know, like the shadow god and the rest of that other stuff. He had a Kabbalah, the cube god. Notice this ain't the cube god represents Saturn. This is a god right here. And this color black chewing is who is Molik, which is the sun god who is Saturn, which is Satan. All this stuff tie. If it's evil, it tie. They turn Saturday, which is the day of the Sabbath, into Saturn, which is the sun god. Never forget that, folks. All this stuff trash. And if you don't understand it, you know, then it ain't, it ain't meant for you to understand. I ain't beating nothing in people's heads. I'm not like certain individuals, the glamorization of witchcraft. So let's celebrate it. They need to know how you feel. Because if you're not happy with doing evil, then you just sold out in vain. Like what I was telling you in the beginning. Here's your T.D. Joshua. Another sellout. A lot of people go to this person's church. Claim to heal individuals. Just another fool on screen. Like the rest of these preachers. They go to church. On a Sunday. And they celebrate. They celebrate the people that they beating down. The real individuals. Mo M M K Ultra Monarch. Mo Celebration. You got another fool on screen right here. Tyler the Creator. You know them. They probably created him from a laboratory, who knows? Shang Tsung, no. And we're gonna finish them. You know, got your butterfly. Having the time of their lives. They gotta put on these fake smiles. You gotta be fake to the devil. So when you have skills and stuff and they really, really wanna recruit you, this is why they get rid of individuals. Cause what they wanna do is turn my videos that don't have no violence in them and to violence. So they want to switch me around. So they want me to be violent in person. Vice versa, or all together, as long as they can get me. Look at little Uzi Bird on screen, celebrating. That's the way it goes, man. Probably don't even want to be there. Look like the, the, the securities, <laughs> you know? They need to know that you're having fun. They hope that you is. Are you enjoying yourself tonight? That's why they ask you how you're doing. Now, some people just ask you that. But when your eyes are open, especially if you're doing stuff like this, and they just sitting back waiting for you to fall, like a lot of individuals is. They kill babies. So I already know what time it is on my end. And in order for me to protect my information, because once again, I don't get paid for this. 
I take this stuff very seriously. Because I don't know who I'm going to reach around the world. When you're dead and gone, that's when they want to celebrate you. But I already know what type of God that is. I'm exposing. Cover these images and the cult symbols for the protection of the viewer. I pray in Yahshua's name, I show these images to you. And you can really see the danger in this. Another celebration. This is witchcraft. You know. All types. And you can just be happy somebody dead in the mind or brain. I told y'all I was going to talk about that terrible dragon, not the phoenix dragon, not the regular one with the ten heads. The terrible one that's in Revelations, the terrible phoenix dragon, because it's all part of the phoenix at this point, which is behind MK Ultra. But I'm going to save that. You know, we're not going to discuss it on this on this topic right here. Spiritual warrior. Are you a spiritual warrior for Jesus then? Or are you just another fool like these individuals who have no identities? Demons don't have no identities. When they enter the soul of an individual, they can't live that long. Five months to a year. Sometimes not even that long. Spiritual wise. We're not even talking about robots and all of that other stuff.